Well, how do you do classic film fans? This is Mike McGee, the classic film reviewer. And recently I ordered online a classic film on Blu-ray made in the late 40s. And in a few moments, we will proceed in reviewing it. So here we go. Now, this package here comes from Kino Lober, Care of Technicolor, from Laverge, Tennessee. And now we're going to uh, proceed in opening, in opening it up. And here it is, El Paso, with John Payne, Gail Russell, Sterling Hayden, and George Gabby Hayes, and Dick Foran. It was made 1949, directed by Lewis Foster, and produced by Piney Thomas, the same people that did those redheads from Seattle. And here's the... Uh, Here's the back cover, and um, let's see, we can read it closely, let's see if we can get a clear, yeah, this is the picture in front, and it says, um, brand new HD master, 4 scan, 35mm, 2 color negative, and it's a um, positive, positive separations. It says, um, after serving the Civil War, an ex-Confederate Captain John Payne um, is ready for a quiet life as a lawyer in peacetime El Paso. However, a corrupt sheriff and a drink and a drunken judge and a uh, a crooked landowner running the town. He decides to form a vigilante group to combat them. Hollywood veterans Lewis L. Foster, redheads from Seattle, directed this action. Packed. Western, which co-stars beautiful Gail Russell, who behind the camera had a drinking problem, Sterling Hayden, and George Gabby Hayes, Dick Foran, and Henry Hull. Now the movie was shot in a process called Cine Color. Unlike early two-color Technicolor, Cine Color could produce mainly a, a wonderful uh, uh, blues and reds and oranges and flesh tones. But when it came to uh, uh, purple and greens, it was muted. Now, now we'll open it up and see what it looks like. This is the inside. This is... Um, this is a, a KL uh, Classic, and it's a, a region. Now, if you did like this review, now, I've seen the movie so many times, and uh, it, 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 it's a very good film, and uh, I found it to be very interesting. And uh, well, what interests me is the early color process, like Cine Color, and their attempt to uh, capture some of the act, some of the accuracy, some of the tones, in order to save money from using Technicolor due to its expense at the time. And um, if you like this review, please comment and subscribe.
El Paso. And John Payne, Car Gail Russell, Sterling Hayden, George Gabby Hayes, and Dick Foran. 1948. 1949, excuse me. Bye.